My name is Russell Foster. We're at Texture Farm here in Crossroads, Texas. I've had the property for nine years. It was a uh, horse property. And when my wife and I left corporate a few years back, we were just puttering around trying to figure out what to do with it. And next thing we know, this happened. Uh, we started planting lavender and introducing alpacas and uh, gourds and Christmas trees and honeybees. And so the primary goal here is for people to come out and experience it for themselves. Uh, in the way of art and classes, as well as feeding alpacas and just getting the experience. So we began with Harvest Host uh, late 2020, so roughly, uh, uh, roughly Thanksgiving time frame. It's been fantastic. So um, we started out thinking, let's do it as a way to have a soft opening. We had not been able to open our shop during uh, the course of 2020. And by having people come in here in small numbers, we were able to kind of control our pace and see what the reception would be like. And we fell in love with it. Everybody who comes through the door is just phenomenal. We get to learn of their experiences on the road, hear stories and so forth. But the other thing we're getting are ideas and a lot of the ideas of the way we've been adapting our business is due to Harvest Host visitors. And so that's been uh, a great thing for us. Along with marketing, um, we get a lot of people uh, outside the state of Texas who normally wouldn't be our customer base making a point of coming by to see us because they've read about us on Harvest Host or they've heard about us through word of mouth and so um, our popularity is spread beyond what we ever thought it would. I think by the way we probably have on average of about uh, five to six visitors a week and it's increasing and so yeah we're, we're probably up in the uh, uh, 50, 60 visitors at this point in time. For us, it's very engaging. Uh, the typical experience um, is that there's a bit of contact, uh, either through phone or through the website, and it's a pretty quick uh, member validation. We get the information, lock them in. Everybody has been very courteous. They let us know when they're going to arrive, what their intention of coming through, whether or not they they plan like a uh, staycation in the area so that they, they can explore uh, everything around this area or whether they're just traveling across country and they're going to be in and right back out. And most of the folks want to engage. They want to tell us about what's been happening on the road, where they've come from. Uh, we get to tell our story quite often. So uh, it's been everything from they're in a hurry, they'd like to conduct a little bit of business with us and then wrap up and move on, to they just want to sit around a campfire and fix dinner for us. In, in our shop here, we had a, a couple who wanted to have us experience uh, their native food. They're from Argentina. And uh, they did a big grill and cooked steak and we had a big steak dinner here in, the, uh, uh, in our shop. So I wouldn't say there's any typical. It's uh, um, the only thing typical about it is they're very pleasant experiences.